Well, I got a story to tell you, just uh, something that happened to me. Um, all right, so check it out. Um, I, uh, I, par- I partied with a Diddy. Oh, I did, yeah. Party with Diddy. Party, uh, party is, you know, sort of a loose term. But, uh, but uh, yeah, so this is what happened, right? Are with me? I got invited to, uh, I signed a publishing deal. I lived in New York City years ago. And I signed a publishing deal. And, uh, you know, it wasn't a good idea, but I did it anyway. And one of the benefits, though, is I got invited to the, to the Christmas party. Um, the big, uh, you know, EMI Christmas party. And, uh, <laughs> and, uh, and so, uh, you know, I was up in the VIP area at one point, right? And then, uh, and then I'm making my way down the stairs, and, uh, and who should be coming up towards me there? Uh, it was Diddy. And so, uh, and so I jumped. I kind of stepped right in front of him, and I thrust out my hand, you know, because I wanted to meet him. Careful. And uh, I know. So I, and I said, uh, I said, Puffy. Big fan, Puffy. You know, I called him Puffy. How embarrassing! You know what I'm saying? I think he had just become Diddy. You know, I'm still in that time in between. That time. Remember the time between Puffy and Diddy? You know, what a, a wonderful time that was. A peaceful, long time, a momentary time of peace fell upon the earth. So yeah, so this hand right here touched uh, Diddy's hand. So I shook my hand. He did. He uh, shook my hand, but without stopping to even look at me. Those empty, you know, dead eyes. I felt like he didn't even see me. I was invisible to him. You didn't just come in to get out of the, the pouring rain. Well, this song is uh, is called the Ballad of Beef Parsley. It goes like this. Oh, 
There was no 